Hey guys, today's on schizophrenia and living according to our values. Schizophrenia and living according to our values. But before we get to this, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I've conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And as far as preludes go, it is quite, quite luxurious. Kind of like a Mercedes Benz. Hello there, my name is Robert Francis. You've stumbled on my Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. Hey, that's Mike the, the Bird. That's Mike. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. He likes to fly in the sun. This is the cut of my jib right here for reasons of my medical confidentiality. Time for a shave. I'm a licensed clinical social worker times 15 years. Indeed, indeed. That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. Indeed. I've been diagnosed with schizophrenia for a score five and one. And that puts a little gray fleck in my beard. Do I mind gray fleck? Thank you for joining me on my channel. Now to topic, to topic, to topic. So sometimes when we have psychosis, you know, we, we have the uh, persecutory ideations and the paranoid ideations and we worry about the intents and behaviors of others and we're on guard all the time. And part of this reason is because we have very, very scary perceptions of the world. But this is our psychosis. And so what I've learned to do is, despite these really scary, scary perceptions and persecutory ideations and paranoid ideations, I have learned something to personally just behave according to my values and not behave according to my perceptions. So that which I see, I do not necessarily believe. And uh, although I'm feeling persecuted or paranoid, I don't act on it because what I do uh, for myself is I act according to my values. And my values are to extend kindness to others and uh, just try to treat other people with respect and uh, just be kind, be nice, according to my values. I, I act according to my values and not according to my perceptions. And that makes life a lot easier. I have scary perceptions, but I just tell myself, hey, just be kind, be respectful, and uh, there certainly will be no regrets to that course of action. So if you're admit psychosis, identify your values and just behave according to your values. I hope that helps. It helps me. All right, me and Mike the bird, he likes to fly in the sun. He likes to fly in the sun. He's a crow. Gotta love Mike. All right, guys, thanks for joining me. I appreciate each and every view. Thank you.